hello guys welcome to my channel once again this is tech pba in this video tutorial i will show you how to mirror your iphone onto your windows pc in this case i'm using a windows 10 pc and then also i'm using an iphone 14 uh, so thanks for joining me and then please before we continue kindly if you are new to this channel kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to sub subscribe to my channel and then um, let's move on so the first thing i'll do is to search for the download of the visa application on my windows 10 pc i'll click on the first link and then once that opens i'll select the windows um, button to download it for windows and I'll click the download button to download the application. So once the application is done, I want to click on that and then click the application itself to begin the installation. Just give the, the setup um, some time for it to complete. It takes a while. Just be patient with it. And then you can see that it's already created the shortcut on the desktop. It means that the installation is done. So from here, the next thing we'll do is to go on to the iPhone, which is an iPhone 14, and then I'll open the App Store to install the Visa application. So I'll search Visa, tap on it, and then I'll tap the download button to download and install the application on this very iPhone. So once done, you want to tap the open to open the Visa application on the iPhone. And you want to select the camera icon to enable or to give it access to your camera. And then also you would you would at, at some point want to tap that icon um, to enable broadcasting on the iphone the broadcasting device application on the iphone so back on the windows 10 pc there are a couple of things we need to take care of so the first thing is is the is to install the apple mobile device supports so i'll click on that click on the um this is a 64-bit machine so i'll select the 64-bit version click on that for it to start the download and then as you can see the download is it's already downloaded the file so i'll click on it to install it but uh, i'm getting a message that the, there's a there's a version on it already a later version on it already so i'll click the finish to exit out of that and then at some point um, you need to connect a visa dongle so this this dongle will actually help you to access your phone on your pc so that is the version that is recommended by the visa application so when you look in the visa application it makes mention of the es uh, esp32 visa dongle so these are these are devices that will enable you to have an effortless um, connection to your Apple device. So I'll connect the iPhone at this stage. And then once you connect it, you will see the play button show beside the iOS device in the Visa application. It means that your device is ready to be accessed on this PC. So I'll click the play button to connect to the, to the phone on this PC. So you can see that um, the connection has begun and then I get this error message. Um, it mean, meaning that the Visa application is not um, started on the iPhone. So I'll make sure to tap on that icon. Then I'll tap the start broadcast to start broadcasting the Visa application on the iPhone to enable us to connect to it on the PC. So once that is done, there's another thing you need to do. You need to um, enable something that would make you um, give you the access to use your 
your mouse on your on your on the on the on the PC or to use the mouse to control your phone on the PC. So to enable it, just go through the on-screen procedure just as we are looking at now in the accessibility session in the settings of the iPhone. So it is the assistive touch. Make sure to enable that. And then once you do that, um, you do that and then you enable broadcasting, you should be able to connect from now. So that is the procedure to calibrate your mouse. Just as we we saw just a few seconds ago. So that is the way to calibrate the mouse to make sure that your mouse will work or you'll be able to use your mouse to control your iPhone on your Windows 10 PC. So once that is done, you would see your iPhone screen <clears throat> show up on your screen, just as we are looking at now. But um, the downside is that um, the connection to the iPhone on this PC was pretty. Sw it was pretty slow. It was really, really slow. And then the other um, thing is that you need an additional device, which is the Visa dongle. To be able to um, control the phone on your on your PC effortlessly without much effort. Other than that, your connection will be very slow. Just as I experienced, it was really really slow moving through the screen. And then the other thing is, I could not really use the mouse to control the phone on this um, PC. So yes, guys, this has been a quick video tutorial on how to mirror your iPhone on your Windows 10 PC. Um, try them out. Let me know in the comment section if your experience is much better than mine. So kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to subscribe to my channel Tech PBA. Turn on notifications for all. Click on the like button if you enjoyed watching this video or if this video was help helpful. Um, share this video and then I will see you in another video. Thank you. Bye.